Echo Alpha Lima is two to the north of the airfield and inbound to join overhead 1,700. I was driving um, an electric car, um, but I was flying petrol planes and so <laughs> I set out to find a solution and that led me to Pipistrelle in Slovenia and they make they made this plane so I had to fly in that and, and I was hooked. So here it is in New Zealand, the first and only at the moment electric plane. It's a Pipistrelle Alpha Electro. This plane is designed as a training aircraft so it flies for around about an hour uh, plus reserves and it takes about an hour to charge. So the idea is when you're learning to fly, all your flights are below an hour anyway, so this could replace almost all our training flights in New Zealand. And if you think about the thousands and thousands of hours we do um, in training flights, that's quite a significant contribution. New Zealand actually has one of the highest rates of short haul flights per capita in the world and um, about 14% of our emissions come from aviation and half of that is short haul. So um, that kind of 10 to 20 seat uh, aircraft is going to be very important for New Zealand and they will be available this decade. A bit like an electric car, this plane does cost a little bit more to buy up front compared to its petrol sister equivalent, um, but it is far cheaper to run. So the maintenance on it is um, next to nothing. Um, there's no maintenance at all on the propulsion system. So it's really an airframe check every, every 100 hours. And um, the cost of fuel equivalent, which is electricity, is of two to three dollars for an hour flight. 